It's pretty straightforward molecular biology these days. Veterinarian Bruce Smith and his team have begun testing a new treatment for bone cancer in dogs that could one day be used to treat humans. It's part of the College of Veterinary Medicine's One Medicine Approach, which takes discoveries in one species and advances health in all species. For example, the project we're going to talk about today, that osteosarcoma uh, clinical trial, is in dogs. Um, and ultimately, we want that to be a clinical treatment in dogs. But it's also something that's going to tell us about how to use this approach in people. So we're very big on this idea of, of one medicine. Osteosarcoma is the most common form of bone cancer in dogs, and we see um, here at Auburn, we probably see one to two cases a month uh, of osteosarcoma, sometimes more. Um, so around the country, uh, you know, we would estimate that there were probably in the range of, of 40 to 60,000 cases a year. In this particular study, treatment consists of a virus normally used as a hepatitis vaccine in dogs that has been modified to only make copies of itself inside bone cancer cells. The virus ruptures the cancer cells, releasing thousands of copies of now, the virus from the tumor cells, into the blood, killing them. And they can spread throughout the body looking for more tumors to infect. So we've engineered this virus to make the tumor cell into a factory to make more virus to kill more tumor cells. There are some very interesting and new types of therapies that are coming down the road for cancer. Um, specifically, if your dog has osteosarcoma and you're interested in participating, absolutely uh, get in contact with your veterinarian and have them contact Auburn. I think this project really does emphasize uh, what ORIC, the Auburn University Research Initiative in Cancer, is all about. So it really does uh, hit home this concept of one medicine where what we learn in people informs what we do in dogs and what we do in dogs tells us what we can do in people.